Hi everyone! In this video I want to show you how to connect Facebook leads to MailChimp for free and without coding. If you do it, you will automatically receive the contact information to MailChimp each time you get a new lead on Facebook. I'll do it with the help of Appyway integration. Appyway is a free integration platform where you can find appropriate software and integrate it with each other, and you don't have to pay or do any coding. Why is it free? Well, the service charges money from software vendors and promotes them in the software marketplace. That's why Appyway is free and has no limits for end users. Let's move on to the integration. First, you need to sign up in the Appyway service. After you've done this, go to the tab Apps and add Facebook and MailChimp. Then go to the My Apps and connect them. Let's start with Facebook. When you click this button, you need to authorize your account. It's important that this user should have access to the Facebook page in which the lead form is done. When you see this green text, Facebook is successfully connected. Now let's repeat this for MailChimp. Click the button plug next Authorize. Here you should input your username and password that you use on MailChimp and click Login. On this page click Allow and it returns you to Appyway. And you see the green text again. Now both services are connected and we can start to configure the integration. I've created a lead form in advance. I hope you already know how to do it. If not, you can easily find such a video on YouTube, there are plenty of them. I return to the Abbey Way and now we should create a way. You can see this button on the top of the page. Click it and let's start. You can give it the name which you need. For example, Facebook and MailChimp. Next, you should specify the trigger. Here choose Facebook Leads. The new lead will be the trigger for the action. Next, choose the page and lead form from the list of ones that you have. Now we need to find Facebook lead form testing tool. It's a standard Facebook tool. Go to this page and in the first sentences there's a link on the tool itself. Click it. This tool simulates the leads in order to check that everything works. I choose this page and this form, which I've already shown you. Now click the button Create Lead, and the tool will send you a testing lead. After that, return to Appyway and click Update Available Fields. The data has appeared. You can create different questions in your lead form and everything you need will be here. Now let's continue with the action. Choose a service here. In our case, it's MailChimp. And here you can see variants of action. Let's choose Add or Update Contact. Now click Update Available Fields again. And the service shows you fields and options which you have on the MailChimp website. Select your audience to which the data will be sent. Next, click the plus sign and choose Email from the list. In the field below you can specify some options like double opt-in and others. I won't do it now because it's not necessary to make integration work. But you can try it on your own and choose what is appropriate for you. But I want you to pay attention to the field tags. With the help of this feature you can assign a certain tag for incoming leads. I created a tag in MailChimp in advance and gave it the name test tag. You can create any tags you need. Now let's fill in some of the fields below. For example, name and phone number. Then scroll the page up and click Test and Activate. If you want to edit this way, you can find it in the tab My Ways, deactivate it and change everything you need. But don't forget to activate it again. Now you should create Test Lead one more time. And here we face up a specific problem. If you just delete this lead and create it again, it may not work. Why? Well, this tool always sends the same email, 
And this is how it looks like. Since lots of people use this tool for testing, the MailChimp consider this tool as an invalid resource, because it has signed up to a lot of leads very recently. In other words, the service thinks that it is a fake and doesn't allow the registration. It's just specifics of Facebook and MailChimp. What should you do to solve this problem? Just delete the existing lead and create a new one through the preview form. Please keep in mind that the transmission of the data may take a little time. Sometimes it comes immediately, sometimes you have to wait for a while. The time of waiting is up to 15 minutes. It's normal. Now I'll go to the MailChimp website. I open the audience, click New Contacts, and you can see that I've already received the data of the test lead, which Facebook has sent. Email, name, phone number and your tag. The integration is working. Using AppAway service you can make integration and automate your work without any problems. And of course, don't forget to go to the AppAway website, look through the categories, choose appropriate software for you and improve your business process.